Hello, hello, and welcome to Wasteland 2, Director Scott. This is Grey Willow with you. And last time, uh, it seems like stuff happened since I last uh, were in uh, Titan's Canyon. Canyon of Titan? I'm not sure how it was called. I don't think it matters much. So, uh, let's... Uh, actually, before we go out, let's uh, call HQ. Copy Ranger Team. Ranger Command, over. Oh yeah, I forgot uh, we had some problems here. Echo one, your team has merit a number of field Yeah, sorry about that. Congratulations. One, you've done a good We'll try our best though. And yeah, let's uh, look uh, into our levels here. No point, no perk, and four skill points. Hmm. What can we do with four skill points? We can upgrade the sniper rifle to make it 100%. That's what we can do. And I like that idea, personally. Now, Ralphie. No skill, no... No, no skill? No. No point, no perk, but skill points. Yeah, brute force sounds like a good idea on him. So, let's commit it. That was pretty easy. So, let's uh, go out now. Hmm. And that is that, there's no middle anymore. It's just that, holy shit. That is honestly way too short. It's kinda weird. I don't like it. Anyway... Uh, should we just immediately go to HQ or... Hmm... HQ is kinda far away. I never was able to do anything with the prison. Hmm... There was also that uh, one place in the corner that I want to investigate. And there's also the city up there too. With the zombies. So you know what, let's uh, go actually check the prison, since it's close uh, to us right now. Calling Ranger Team Echo. Please respond. Uh, go ahead. 10-4 Echo-1, good to hear your voice. Now listen, a situation occurred while you were off the air. The Red Scorpion Militia has gotten a bee in their bonnet about something, and they've been sending squads into our territory to harass our people and sabotage our works. Danforth is calling it retribution for ranger atrocities, but I got no idea what he's talking about. Whatever it is, it's got to stop. Copy? Uh, copy that. 10-4. Unfortunately, all other teams are currently out trying to chase down these damn hit squads, so you're on your own. I need you to get to the prison and see what the hell is up Danforth's ass. And if you can get him to calm down or make peace, then do what you have to do. Disrupt his operations, destroy his base, kill him, capture him. I don't care what it is. Just get the little pest off our backs. We're not going to be able to send you to L.A. unless this mess is dealt with. You read me? Loud and clear, sir. 10-4, Echo-1. And get moving. Citadel base out. All right, so it seems like we're going to the prison either way. their attempts to turn the towns we protect against us. But this latest act is too vile. It cannot be forgotten. It cannot be forgiven. The Desert Rangers are killing our dogs. They've infected our loyal hounds, our best friends, our constant companions, with a plague that is killing them in the most cruel, barbaric fashion possible. Their paws bleed, their mouths froth, their eyes weak pus. They stop eating, they stop moving, and then they die. Vargas! Do you hear me? You've gone too far this time. This isn't just one doll. This is a hundred. And it isn't a little boy whose best friend you've killed. It's your worst enemy. I'm coming for you, Vargas. I'm gonna kick down your wall and cut your throat. I was always coming, Vargas. But I was biding my time, building my militia, getting it ready for the day when we would take over all of Arizona and leave the Desert Rangers bleeding in the dust where they belong. Well, you forced my hand, Vargas. The day you let your plague loose among my dogs was the first day of the rest of your short, short life. You will die for this, Vargas. I'll have your head on a stake. Sounds pretty passionate. Also, tough words for someone uh, within sniping range. So, I'm guessing uh, reds are gonna be uh, pretty much populating this entire thing. Unless it's uh, the exact same as I left it last time. Hmm, let's see, let's see. I'm gonna go from the front. Oh wait, the merchant is not here. Interesting. 
Yeah, it seems like it's exactly the way I left it the last time, so, uh... Yeah. What was that? You just got uh, scrap on him. Hmm. I don't like this, but let's dig anyway. Hmm, okay. Just stuff, I guess. That's kind of weird, and I just not see it last time. That's so weird. Oh, wow, apparently I missed some stuff. Huh. Let's uh, look around. I do remember there were some things that uh, I completely missed. Okay, let's pick this up. Yeah, I didn't even know about that one, too. Did I know about it? I'm not sure. I'll be completely honest, not sure at all. Uh, yeah, give it to him and distribute. Wait, what's that? Oh, I probably destroyed the thing. Yeah, I think that was from the thing. Oh yeah, I'm a lot more prepared to t to open these things. That's nice, and now safe crack it. So, what do we have here? A phone. Amazing. All that work just for a phone. Anything here? No. Okay, safe crack this. Yeah, I can easily safe crack stuff now. Wow. Nothing interesting though. So let's uh, accept variants, so might as well. Was there anything up here besides the obvious? I still remember these uh, fucking, fucking things. Yeah, I opened them the hard way. Oh, there was something here. Okay, interesting. Was it like a key? Oh, it's uh, booby trapped. God damn it. <sighs> yeah, I can remove the trap pretty easily. But safe cracking apparently still pretty hard. Interesting. I can. I'll try it anyway. Critical failure, amazing. Well, at least I can I cannot crit fail uh, fixing it. But yeah, apparently I'm still too low to actually open it. I have no idea why. That's so weird. But in any case, uh, I think there was something else here. Yeah, this thing. Um, yeah, I didn't really realize this, but I can't use it. Access denied, yeah. But I was told I could just... Yeah, hack it, simple. Okay. Success. Brain activated, please stand clear. So, it, uh, interesting. It both makes a, a new path. Oh, toaster. I couldn't open the toaster as well, apparently. So it opens a new path and actually, it opens, it opens two paths, actually, now that I think about it. Juniper berries? Huh. No idea what that is. But yeah, now I have uh, another path to go through. And if I am correct, I think I know where this leads, actually. If I am correct. I don't think I am, but who knows, really. That was a dog sound. <laughs> what? Okay, there's uh, stuff I can open here. Okay, okay. Yeah, I remember these. These two. Yeah, I remember failing this. I can brute force it, actually. Nice. So let's see what's inside. Laser car- Ah, that's weak. That's pretty weak. Oh, right here. Oh, easy safe crack. And... Uh, eh, not bad, not bad. Could be better, though. And I think that's it for this place. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's it. But yeah, it seems nothing respawns, so I literally have an easy run through this entire place. I'm pretty sure nothing respawned here too. Yeah, nothing respawned, so literally no danger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think anyone, yeah, I don't think anything was there. Yeah, the bombs. Bombs? Mines. I keep calling them bombs, I don't know, it's just easier for me personally. Oh, apparently there was something here that I completely missed. Interesting. Very strange, very strange. Well, in any case, uh, up we go, since we don't have any resistance anyway. Hmm, it's talking about traffic jam. Uh, let's see how these guys hmm. are. Hmm. Yeah, I have a feeling he'd probably see me. I was looking for, like, the workers, if they were still here. But I don't truly really see them. Yeah, only foreman left here. Not sure what happened to all the workers, that's a little concerning. Just a tiny bit. In any case, uh, let's uh, kill all the guys here. That is pretty gruesome, gotta say. I have no idea how that worked. Just sit down, I guess. 
Oh no, that's bad. Thankfully, that was just dynamite, though. So, not the worst that could have happened. Also, they have numbers, but those numbers don't really mean much of anything, in all honesty. Oh uh, yeah, let's get rid of this guy. And this guy. Well, this, uh, getting rid of this guy will be slightly harder. Very slightly. Eh, uh, sure. Actually, go. What a nice place. Oh. Sure are a lot of guards on this farm. 87 missed, goddammit. Uh, do you... You have Pine Bomb. Okay, that's uh, enough, actually. I can't go over from here. I may... What? Oh, that's something I can't go... Okay, okay, where? How good is my throwing arm? Not that great. It's pretty shit. Ah, uh, well, oh well. I'm pretty sure that makes it uh, possible for them to shoot me, but I don't care enough for that. Oh. Apparently I don't have uh, an angle anymore here. That oh. Well, that's dumb. Okay, fine. I guess uh, you're the target then. Goodbye. He really wants that guy dead. Hmm. Yeah, it's gonna take him a while to get everyone here. Yeah, these are weak ones. Honestly... Yeah, focus on this one. I want uh, to tear down this guy from here. First shot hit, that's all I needed. Perfect. Shoot this guy. Hmm. Okay. And from here... Eh, good enough. Yeah, foreman. Pretty easy. Oh, I can't actually reach that one. Interesting. Yeah, you don't know. You, you know what? I don't, don't really care about the whippy, wimpy ones. Actually, grenadier? No. Doesn't look like it. But let's get rid of that guy. Oh, okay. So it's, they are grenadiers. Ow. It did seem not as armed as uh, you'd think. Eh, sure, let's uh, focus on this guy. Oh, interesting. First shot. Oh, it completely destroyed the cover too. Well, that's kind of bad. Okay, run forward. Oh, there is this guy. I completely forgot about him. Hmm. Hmm. Well, that's unfortunate. Uh, lucky shot. Lucky shot, but non-conductive armor, so... Pretty useless. Pretty useless. Uh, just run all the way and just kill them. Ouch. Weapon jam. Nice. Actually, yeah, you know what? Mine's better. Okay, switch to the other one, and uh, run as far as you can, I guess. Eh, sure. Didn't hit. That's sad. Pretty sad. Okay, perfect. This one hit. And he can move a bit closer. Wait, does the other one doesn't give evasion? Why not? Only this one does. I have no idea what. Well, ambush from here. Let's see how the dog looks, uh, the uh, shotgun. Not that much, not that much it seems. But, oh well. Oh, that's pretty bad. Hmm. Oh, there's th that guy still there. All the pigs are dead. That sucks. And... He just runs forward, he really does not care. Okay, you wanna play like that? Dead. Okay. So that's all the foreman uh, done with. It's, uh, pretty easy, if you ask me. Oh, apparently I didn't take that one for some reason. 
Well, yeah, this is uh, this was pretty easy. This is like early game. Oh, okay. They actually give me TNT. Interesting. But yeah, these are like uh, early enemies. They just don't pose a threat to me, honestly. That's how RPGs works in general. So whatever. Oh, so that was an actual sniper. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, let's uh, break free. Break it. Sadly, the pigs are dead. Hmm. Sucks. But I can't do much about that. This is for the TNT, so sadly I kind of have to get it. And of course, success. Hmm. You. Yeah, me. Give me a moment, I just need to disconnect uh, these things. Okay, and then I just need to open it. Okay, so... Yeah, you survived. That's pretty good. Yeah, yeah, it's me. It's all your fault, Rangers. If you'd finished off the red scorpions like I told you, huh? I never would have... Oh, God. I never would have what? I... I'm the one who made the dog sick. And I told the sc scorpions that the rangers were the ones who did it. It was the only way I could think of uh, to make you to finish Danford like I told you to. We did try to finish him, you dumb motherfucker. You... Well... Well, you could have told me. I never would have tricked him into attacking you if I'd known you couldn't. Fuck. I fucked up. Yes, you did, you dumb motherfucker. Make us? I tried to appeal to your pity, but you didn't listen. The fate of few, a few poor farmers wasn't enough to get you to find Danford in the prison and kill him. So I tricked him into attacking you. I knew you couldn't turn away from a direct threat. How did you make this talk sick? There's a plague. Blisterpaw, it's called. Uh, it's seen uh, some wild dogs with it uh, out in the scrub, so I caught one and brought it to the farm. The poor guard dogs. It spread so quickly. I... I was going to cure them as soon as uh, you and the scorpion started fighting, but then I realized that I... That if I did, Danford would guess it was me who'd infect them. And I was too afraid. And my plan didn't even work. The rangers were supposed to kick Danford's ass, and he's kicking yours. Now the scorpion's gonna rule everywhere. Do you have the cure? Yes, but I can't give it to the dogs. Commander Daffer will kill me as soon as I do. You need to cure the, the dogs, the motherfucker. But, but Daffer loves those dogs more than he loves people. He'd cut me to pieces. You have to protect me. I'm not going there. Ah, just give the cure to us, then, the motherfucker. Well, alright. But I'm only doing this for the dogs. I never should have hurt them. Just a drop uh, is all that's needed. This should be more than uh, you'll ever need. Please don't tell him it was me. I'm sorry for all the trouble. Yeah, later. Gee, that's great. Uh, game, game. <laughs> game decide uh, it plays whatever the fuck he wants. Hmm. Okay, can't get out there. Oh, there was uh, something, something else here. Okay. Yeah, let's destroy it as well. The thing is that I can't even get mad at the asshole, because, let's be completely real, yeah, he, the reds were pretty much killing the farmers here, for free, and taking, get, getting manual labor out of it too. So you really didn't have a lot of uh, choices on what to do, and the obvious one, oh shut up, and the obvious one was, obviously, to get the rangers to attack him. Alarm activated. Alarm was already activated, the motherfucker. Okay. Hmm. Actually, I think there are mines here. Oh, I actually already triggered all. Apparently, I did not trigger all of them. Hmm. Interesting. Um, just a moment. Yeah, that was kind of dumb. I was pretty sure I was done with that, but apparently not. Okay. So, oh. Interesting, interesting. A toaster, a very easy toaster. Preparation G? What the hell is that? No idea. Anyway. So, the dog killers have returned. Mm hmm. Cross the line of stones, Rangers. I'm begging you. Come forward and die like the dogs you killed. We found a cure for the dogs, by the way. You have a cure? No bullshit? I, I don't believe it. I, uh. Well, all right, Rangers. I ain't gonna turn down a chance to cure my dogs. 
But if you're lying to us, you're dead. Hear me? First of all, no I'm not. Second, yes I do have a cure. So, where are these dogs? Keep your hands where you can see them and keep walking. You better have the cure. For a sec, you better have that cure. Keep walking around ages. A tall, hard-eyed man with a purple scar across his uh, clean cut left cheek. The hate in his eyes looks hot enough to burn you to the ground. I would dearly love to cut you up and feed you to our dogs. But if you really have a cure, then stand right where you are and wait. The boss is coming. If you don't have a cure, then make a move. It'll be your last. We have the cure. You Come better, Raina. You can make it, girl. I want you to see the man who did this to you. And then, I'll kill them. Mm-hmm. Are you sure about that? The leader of the Red Scorpions is younger than you expected, hardly out of his 20s. A broad-shouldered guy with a baby face that no man of armor or uh, scruffy beard can hide. His eyes change from warm to ice cold as he looks at it. as a sick dog to you. So, Rangers, they tell me you can cure my dogs. Can you raise the dead ones too? Can you bring Rex back to me? Who's Rex? You don't know the name? How about the name Bobby? Ring any bells? Of course not. The Rangers are a fucking steamroller that doesn't stop to learn the names of the insignificant ants it crushes beneath its wheels. Mm hmm. Well, let me tell you a little story. Once upon a time, a boy and his dog lived in High Pool, and one day the Rangers came to town and killed the dog. Oh, they said it had rabies, but does that explain them gunning down the little boy, too, when he was armed with nothing but a BB gun? Any wonder that when that little boy clawed his way back from the edge of the grave, he vowed to hurt the Desert Rangers worse than they'd hurt him? Any wonder that he started the biggest, baddest gang in the land and made the Desert Rangers their public enemy number one? So you're Bobby. Well, that only took 15 fucking years. Give the Ranger a cigar. Now, see if you can guess the size of the hole I'm going to put in your head. You're getting we're a militia Rangers. now, Ranger. The law in these parts. And pretty soon, we're going to be the law in all of Arizona. My dream has always been to show you fucking cowboy tyrants how to do peacekeeping right. Treat the people with respect, not kill their children. So slavery is uh, respect. Ah, we're in transition. I'm getting rid of the bad apples as quick as I can. And people are easier to protect when they're under tight control. If everybody works on the company farm, we don't have to patrol a bunch of far-flung cabins and shacks. Everybody's happy, right? Have you asked the people if they're happy? Sometimes the people don't know what's best for them. Sometimes you have to force them into good decisions. They'll thank us later. Trust me. So, if we've done slavery, would you be happy? That's different. The rangers are a bunch of dog-killing bullies who don't care what happens to the little people. But you're basically no better than raiders yourselves. Because... because... Okay, maybe forcing people isn't the best way. But how else are you supposed to get them all organized and protected? How are you supposed to get all the gear and guns you need unless you tax them? Well, you can ally with us, I guess. Ha, that's rich. Me take advice from the Desert Rangers? Why would I want to do that? Well, we had a cure this entire time, and we brought it to you, instead of, you know, shooting you in the head. I think that counts for something, right? All right, Rangers, all right. You made your point. I guess we've got some things to learn. Okay, you cure my dogs, I'll pull back my boys and come to the table. But no promises that it'll all work out, peaches and cream. And if you kill any of my dogs, the deal's off, and you're dead. Start with Raina here, and head to the kennel. Come back when you're done. Okay, sounds fair enough. Uh, what was the cure again? Let me check uh, which one had the cure. I don't remember which one had the cure, I'll be completely honest. Oh, she had the cure, okay. Okay, let's cure the little doggy. Like, the dogs didn't do anything, they shouldn't be in this. Raina, she's better already. Amazing. Now, go to the kennel. Rangers, hurry. Hey, I'm, 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 I'm running, I'm running. 
How you feeling, Raina? Who's a good girl? Who's a good girl? Uh, where's the colonel? Kennel again? Yes, sir. A fine-looking bitch, sir. Uh, where's the kennel? Dog, scorpions, scorpions. I see a dog up there, so maybe here. Yeah, this looks like the kennel. Look at all the doggies! Hello, doggies. Though he's dressed in militia armor, he doesn't have uh, that red scorpion swagger. He's an older, calmer man, who obviously cares for the dogs that are his responsibility. Never thought I'd see rangers in the prison. Does Commander Daffer know you're here? Daffer asks us to cure the dogs. That explained it then. Usually, when he speaks of you, he's... You're demons from hell. But he just loves his dogs, and well, look at them. They need all the help they can get, even from demons. What's wrong with the dogs? Don't know what struck them down. First was old uh, Siggy, got these uh, weeping uh, lesions on their paws, and uh, then she stopped eating. Then she died. I figured it was uh, just a poor gal getting old and feeble, but then they all got sick. It hit everybody pretty hard around here. And Bobby's is the worst. Tell me about him, though. Commander Daffert uh, seems like a, a hard man, I guess it was supposed to mean. Well, he's got a soft spot for dogs. We all do. I don't know how we'll carry on if they all die. Can you help us fix this? Poor creatures. Anything a bit, ain't a thing I've been able to do for them uh, except make them comfortable. If you can cure them, it, well, it would mean the world to me. We'll try to cure them. Bobby says you're the Antichrist, but I don't give a god, a good goddamn. Apparently, if you can help our dogs, then you're okay in my book. Good luck, Rangers. The dogs are counting on you. Oh wow, that is a lot of doggies. Let's try and help them. Oh my god, get all the, get all these dogs. That is a lot of dogs. <laughs> I can't believe my life. Get the rest. Oh my god, you really have a cure. The cure, it's working. I mean, yeah, hopefully. Look at her, she's feeling better already. Hey, excuse me, what's that? Amazing! Just three others to cure. Yeah, I think I have enough for three more. Aha, I never thought I'd see her so happy. They're all just dog. Well, probably because I don't know them. Praise science, just one more to go. Come on. Come on, Gunner. Show them why you're the leader. Cure them dogs. And that's that. I'll be damned. It worked! You've eaved my very heart, Rangers. Go tell Danford. He'll do backflips. Hey Rangers, what's up? Doggy treats. Would your dogs enjoy some uh, rawhide chews? We found some in the toaster in the Monta. In a, in a toaster? Who the right man would put it? Or whatever. Uh, if you got them, my dogs will love them. They'd be your best friends uh, from here till Judgment Day. Here, you can have them. Wow, package isn't open. They ain't rotten. Dogs go crazy for these. Didn't expect to, to be saying this, uh, I'm real husband here for that makes okay. Uh, this much, but thanks, Rangers. Here's a token of the dog's appreciation. Okay, good luck, Rangers. Hmm, maybe there's more to red scorpions than just uh, mindless raiders. Maybe. Maybe. But uh, we'll figure that out next time when we confront Danford once again. I do thank you very much for staying with me this entire time. This has been uh, Grey Willow. If you have any sort of comments, suggestions, or criticism that you'd like to leave, you can always leave it in the comment section down below. Thank you once again for staying with me, and I do hope that you will have a wonderful day. Goodbye.